Hello YouTube, welcome to day 24 in Minecraft. If you guys have been enjoying my series so far, please hit that like and subscribe button. We're going to get started. I don't really know what I'm going to do today. I'm probably just going to run around and look stupid because I don't really have any plans to do anything on this one other than run around and look stupid. It's kind of the plan. Uh, I think I might go mining though. Yeah, mining sounds like a good idea. Which, we're going to be going in the uh, little underground cavern slash room that I have down here. Um, we're going to be saving that iron pickaxe. I don't want to waste my iron pickaxe to build a tunnel. And we're going to be going way down towards the bottom, starting right here. Haha, <laughs> what you looky there, I already got an iron ore. We're not going to worry about those right now, though. This is my way I'll collect them anyways. But, uh, we're going to be going down to, like, level 6. For so in bedrock. Because I really need to try to find some more, like, good ore. Redstone gold. That way we can find the end... You get to the nether, have some fun, you know. The good stuff. Oh. Change the pass now. So, there's not a whole lot going on on here other than we're going to see how low I can get down here into the uh, mine shafts area. Hopefully I can run into one or two. If not, just I need to get down to level six. That way I can start getting some good stuff. Um, you might notice that I am literally wasting my pickaxe right now trying to build this oversized tunnel. I just prefer this style of tunnel um, because a lot of times when I'm mining and whatnot I get unlucky and have to face like a skeleton or whatnot going back up to my base and I really don't like losing all the stuff I have. And with this style of tunnel it, it allows me some access points where I can like get like say the skeleton's right up there I can come over this way and it has to come down here to fight me. And then I just sit here and basically corner them so that way they can't really move forward any and I just sit there and I keep attacking them and attacking them until they die I would not recommend trying to do that against a bunch of mobs however I've been known to use fence posts and half slabs to do the same thing which makes it where I back myself into a corner and they can't come through but I can still attack them which is fun it's a lot of fun it makes it easy on me, and it sucks for them, because they dies, and that's okay. I like it when day dies. Not entirely sure what level I'm at, but we're going to keep digging down here. Maybe in a little bit I'll pop up the uh, screen that shows how far I've dug down. What my Y coordinate is. Anyways, 
This is a lot of fun. Sitting here talking about random shit while I work on mining. But Let's see here. Ooh! Uh -huh -huh. Look at what I got. We're getting deeper. I see some gold. That is part of the reason why we're down here. This is why I've been saving that iron pickaxe. So when I get down here, I can get the good stuff. Then we'll go and smelt this and sell it to one of the priests in that village. If they're still alive, that is. Hopefully they are. I don't much want them to die because I still need their stuff. So I can get some eye of enders and whatnot. At least if I remember correctly, they, they do that. I don't remember though. It's been a long time. And I'm out to wood, so we're just going to switch right over here. To this iron pickaxe and continue mining. Alrighty. Let's see what level I'm at. We are currently at 17. We need to go further down. The ways. Now, one thing you'll notice with my screen here while I record over there to the right, it shows the sounds of what's going on right now in the game. I kind of use that for when I'm mining and when I'm at hunting because you can kind of see when someone's or something is coming up behind you, such as a skeleton or a zombie. Or when you're down here mining, when you're getting close to lava. So you don't get stupid and run straight into it. Okay, we got about six more to go down. And trust me, I've done that before. I wasn't really paying attention to what was going on. I just like it when it pops up. Yeah, see, like right there, it just popped us and lava pops. Which means we're getting closer. Yeah, see, yeah, you can kind of hear it. Maybe. No, not anymore. Ha uh -huh, looky there, Redstone. Which is why we're down here. Land and gold and diamonds. We like our diamonds. Alrighty. At this point, we're actually going to kind of excavate this area out a little ways. Um, from right here. Mainly just to create a spot in which I can branch off out from here. Um, to make this a little easier on myself. Okay, so starting here, we're just going to mine a bunch of wet blocks this way. And we will continue doing that until otherwise noted. Now it's getting a little hard to see, so we pop one of those down. Perfect.
Alrighty guys, we're gonna go a little ways further. And then maybe in the next video we will try to find some diamonds. Because diamonds are fantastic and I like diamonds. Oh, there's some more redstone. That's nice. I am probably going to be going until this pickaxe officially breaks. Um, just to keep it simple. That act simple. And then I will go up to the top world and build another iron pickaxe and do it again. Um, a little further over from here. And then once that happens, I will go in and uh, escalate this a little further with a stone pickaxe. That way I can just kind of keep them all similar. And I also kind of like the way this tunnel looks. I mean, look at that. It's kind of neat looking. But we're going to head up to the uh, house there, and I'm going to pop that gold into the, um, the furnace. <sighs> This is the only part that sucks about this part. Is that you have to constantly jump. But, there we are. Hehe, <laughs> creeper. Alrighty, so let's pop this six gold I got into a furnace. Along with that iron. And I don't know, maybe in the next video I will I know in the next video I'm definitely going to go back down and mine more. Um, with an iron pickaxe. We're gonna bring a couple down with me. Um, just to make it a little better. That way I can put in a couple more tunnels first. Um, and hopefully during that time we ended up, we end up stumbling across some diamonds. If not, oh well. We'll see. I hope we do. That would be, that'd be great if we stumbled across some diamonds while we were down there. That would definitely be some awesome stuff. But chances are, sadly, we probably won't. But we can hope. Um, real quick, towards the end of this video, I'm just going to go and reorganize some of the stuff, which is kind of boring. I apologize. But I've got to get this stuff figured out um, so that way it's out of the way and I can focus on the more fun things um, for example we're gonna put stuff away so it's in an organized manner I'm gonna put my couple of stone in here um, if you guys want and you're interested in seeing it let me know hit put in the comments below this video that uh, you guys want to see me build that storage tower, the skyscraper I was talking about. Um, if you do, I'd be happy to go and do it. It's it's not that hard to do. It's actually a very fun one. It just requires a lot of lava. Um, and water. It's, it's rather hard to do in survival mode. Because you do run the chance of constantly falling down. Which, of course, always sucks, but it is what it is, kind of thing. But, if you guys want to see that, let me know. I would be happy to go do it. It's actually a lot of fun. I've always enjoyed building that. Um, I like making it look neat, because it's fun that way. Um, it's also really, really hard to do because you do have to worry about falling down into the lava while you're doing it so it's not something that's super easy to do but once you build it it's it's actually really really worth it I mean you're talking the ability to put all your stuff into a tower literally 
Um, I use it to store all the different things I have. And I even break it down so that way each and every single item I have has its own little room. Like its own chest that it goes into. Um, it's really good. It's, it is rather hard to build. But the great thing about it is it's one of those builds that once you get the base of it built, you don't really have to worry about building it after that. Um, and it makes a great waypoint mar marker. Because, I mean, you can build them huge. I've put 9, 10, 11, 12 stories in them before. And that's leaving three spaces at each story. So I could have a total of two to three high stacks of ch chests they're stacked instead of being like this where you only get one here and one here it would be one two and three and all of which you'd open in because i would put i put uh, half slabs up above them it's actually really nice i enjoy doing it that way um and then the great thing about doing that is you don't have to worry about oh am i gonna have to reorganize this chest or move this in this place because i ain't got enough space or am I going to have to move this over here because I'm running out of space in this chest? You don't worry about that anymore. All you have to worry about is what exactly I want in each room. Like, I tend to break floors down based on the types of goods. So, like, wooden trap doors and these oak fences and cobblestone walls, the windows, the uh, stairs... Um, all that stuff I tend to put into a floor called decoration. And I put all sorts of stuff like some more chests, ladders. Uh, I put that stuff in there because it's easier and it stays out of my way. And get off my roof. You staying down now? No, you don't want it. Alrighty. Get off my roof. Stay off my roof. you ha ha and that is another reason why I actually keep those uh, trap doors like that is because I can sit here and wait until they come up right here it's like and down they go it's fantastic it's a lot of fun keeps me safe and keeps them dead la 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 yeah, actually we're going to put that there we're going to put that there Uh, put that in there. As you can see, I'm still trying to kind of figure out where I want things to go. Oh, trust me, that's going to take a few videos. Eh, there's some good food. I'm just stum 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 Because that's totally the way it sounds when you eat food. Please know that I am being sarcastic. That is not how you actually eat food. I would not recommend doing that. Especially if your parents like to, uh, like you to have manners. Trust me, it won't end well. But. And this is part of the reason why I don't record. I don't have a sound booth, so I can't keep things quiet. The other part is because I just sit here and I talk about stupid things. Like what I might do and then I just don't do it like a dumbass. You know, I just went on an entire video basically and said, oh, I'm going to go do this. And then I turn around and I don't go do that. Not the way that's supposed to work. But I do it anyways. Because it's fun. Because it keeps you people guessing what I'm going to do next. I like making people guess. Keeps my time interesting, isn't it? We're gonna keep stacks of sixty-four of these up here, and a redstone, coal, iron. That as soon as I get diamonds and shit, they'll go in here. Except for my emeralds. The moment I get emeralds, I'm gonna go spend them on the uh, ender pearls, but as fast as I can. Probably isn't the smartest idea, but I'm going to do it anyways. I need to build more of those. 
cut paper. Cut leather. That's in here. Let's see if I remember the uh, thing. I think it's like this. Hell yeah, there it is. Got that shit right for a change. I might build a map. Yeah, I'm totally gonna go build a map. That would be really, really smart to go by build me a map. I got the stuff for it. One, two, three, four. No. Well, I have most of the stuff for it, I should say. I have all the stuff for it. Now we're just gonna go plant a birch tree. Out my front door. Like right here. Immediately afterwards, we're gonna run over here and be like, Skadoosh! Nozzle. Don't ask me what a Skadoosh nozzle is because I don't really don't know. You die, you f flipping zombies. Oh, there are a lot of pigs over here. Another reason why I need to build a map. I don't remember shit. I honestly don't even remember how long this video is. Don't mind me, Mr. Enderman. I'm just gonna sneak up here and hit you in the face and hopefully not die. I am totally probably gonna die here. But that's okay. I want you to die, Mr. Enderman. Because I need your pearl. That's what I need. You piece of... Cattle dropping cow pie thingy bobber. You damn near killed me and then you didn't even give me what I wanted. God damn indies. No, no creeper. None of that. Stop it. Back out of my go. Back it up. Really? Really? See? This is why I built that mob spawner. It's because you don't drop shit want something, you gotta, like, take forever to try to find the goddamn thing. And then, just when you think you're gonna get it, you don't. Because things like to be assholes. Watch. I'm waiting to be attacked. I am totally waiting to be attacked. <gasps> Is that another indie? I see me another indie. Nundy, 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 lender indie man. Don't mind me, Mr. Indie man. I really hope you drop the block as soon as I start hitting you. Because that would be awesome. Ho pow! 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 Thank you, Mr. Indie. I needed that. Thank you for your little under pearl. Now I get to go find your goddamn base. And as soon as I find your goddamn base, I'm gonna kill some more sips you. But first I'm gonna have to bring like a shit ton of cobblestone. After I kill the ender dragon, of course. And pumpkin head. That way the Indies don't attack me. Yeah, no, none of that. Hi, Mr. Creeper. Boy. Splash. Hey, look you there. Are you going to be a hostile mob? Yes, you are. I should have expected that. Thank you very much. What don't I need? I don't need these things. I hate always, how many of those I always get. Shaboomstick. Let's see here. Shut <sighs> boom da 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 
We have enough for one bookshelf. Alrighty, guys. I need to eat something before I die. I got cooked food up here. Item drops, item drops, item drops. Alright, so I'm gonna eat me some dinner or steak and then I'm gonna go to go to sleep. <gasps> no! That is so not allowed. Good night. Goodbye. Much well, better. Yeah, I prefer these because you can actually open them and shoot shit. Whereas, like, with glass panels, you can't really open them. And then you can't do this with glass panels. You can't open this up and be like, Bominos! Only to go into a different room. Like, I mean, you can't do that. Like, it don't work that way. That's, that's how great these things are. They're so useful. And like you can't like here, spider can sit here. I can hit the bitch. Spider can sit here. I can hit the bitch. Spider can sit over here, and I can straight up just like nail him right over here. Like there is, like, psh, psh, psh. and I'm like, hey, no arrows hit me. It's a great thing about those things. So you ain't got to worry about shit. You might have to worry about shit. I wouldn't quote me on that. You know what I can't remember how to make? You know what I should do? Why am I doing that? I should take one of these and put it up here. Because that will become useful. But, um, I'm trying to think. I think it's made like this. Here. Um, I think you go like two here. One of these, like in the bottom. One, like right there. And I think like that. Hell yeah, that's the recipe. Sweet. And I need four of those. Means I should totally have just enough. Because we need at least three across the top. We need three right there. We need three right there. And I don't have enough because I need 12 cobblestone. Now we have enough. So, like that. That goes there. Three of these go here. Hopefully I will have enough to make four. Oh, I'm going to be short by like three though. Oh well. We'll have the majority of them anyways. Yep, see, there's three. Need three more. Three more redstone. I would be perfect. Shit. You want to know what? Screw that idea. Why am I going to make a block of that when I could just do one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four. Oh, wash a fucking law. Don't waste so goddamn many materials. You ain't that rich. Hell yeah, well, no, I ain't. Thank you. Alrighty. I get a switch down here.
Oh, this fucking thing. Oh, why'd I go and do that? I don't want to do that. Here. I did do. Alrighty.
Oh yeah. Yeah, it's a coming right along. So I have plenty of work to do, but hey. We're just gonna show a bunch of this shit away because I'm not gonna need the majority of this. No, there's not. A sword, lighting, shitty pickaxe. Actually, we're going to do one iron pickaxe first. There we go. Well, guys, we're going to see you in the next video.